are back with another video of Jurassic Park Builder. As you can see, there's a new DNA dinosaur or glacier animal in the game. It is about the weekend of January 9th, 2015, and this is the first release. So here is the limited edition offer, and you win it through the fights. Now, let me just go back over here. This dinosaur is only available for this week, which means that it will be gone on January. 12th 2015 and it's almost gone so here it is in its egg form we're gonna hatch the egg now and there it is all right so the, this is known as the terrible crocodile I'm assuming it resembles to a crocodile that's why they they given it that name so this is dinosaur was not dinosaur animal was available during the late Cretaceous area but anyways I mean, <laughs> era. All right, so here it is, and we're just going to tap on it. All right, definitely looks like a crocodile. Definitely it. I mean, it has the jaw of a crocodile and the body of a croc. Oh, it moves super quick. All right, so that that's something that's a bit different. Let me zoom out a bit. So there it is, and, you know, let's zoom back in. This is the baby form, but being in the baby form, Oh, this dinosaur, this creature looks really, moves really quickly. I mean, being in the baby form, this animal moves really, really quickly. All right, let's just level it up and see what happens. All right, you notice when we feed it, look at it eat the stuff. Although there's nothing there, it's invisible. But you can make out if there is an enemy there, this is what he's going to do. And that's how he's going to bite it. Oh, it, it's definitely not going to end well. We're going to feed it. And this is a meat eater, if you're wondering. There it is again. He's just flicking those the food there. This is the second, I mean the first form. We're going to evolve it. Level 5 right now, it's going to transform right now. Let's see, look at the second form. Oh, wow, this thing is gigantic. I mean, it is huge. Definitely not small. Look at the size of that creature. All right, so that's how it roars too. It makes a really loud sound. There it is again. So let's watch it walk around a bit and then we'll evolve it to the next form and then we'll take a look at the next form to see how it is. Alright, so here it is the second form, the information for the second, well actually I guess the second evolution screen. Here it is, we're going to check out the next form. Form. All right, we're back, and as you can see, this is the next form of this animal. And what happened was, I think he just put, they just put like darker stripes onto the, the gray, dark gray skin that he had before. Well, I guess it was kind of like dark green or palish green, anyways. There it is. This is the second evolution as you can see it's really the same thing I think he's moving slower now I'm not sure actually I don't I don't think it, they actually changed the movement but maybe it was a glitch before he's moving very well actually now now he's moving quickly all right so anyways that is the baby form of the first I mean second evolution and you know what let's take a look at the next form All right, he still eats like that. I'm gonna feed it up. All right, get ready for this. This is gonna be a big one. And here we go. Okay, so he's huge. Again, he's back. This guy is gigantic. Let's feed him again. That's how he eats, if you're wondering. All right, he is still a lot bigger. You'll notice that the feet, right there at the bottom, there's... A lot of claws. That's something I didn't notice before. Also, big tail, orange, and yellow eyes. In my opinion, they are that color. Let me zoom out a bit. Okay, so he's just 
he's still moving really quickly. I mean, he is easily bigger than the T-Rex, I like, in the game, in this game. If I was able to compare the T-Rex with this creature, I think this creature is bigger. Maybe. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Do you think the T-Rex is bigger here? Not not according to stance and information, but right on this game. I think the T-Rex is smaller, but we'll have to see about that. But we're going to move on to the next evolution and take a look at that. Alright, so we're back with the third evolution screen. As you can see, this animal grew as large as 36 feet, according to the information found. But here it is, and what we're going to do now is check out its third form. All right, it's in its third form, and it's really, really, really strange, in my opinion. I mean, where have you seen a blue crocodile? <laughs> well, I guess uh, you could say the same for where have you seen a green crocodile. But anyways, uh, here it is. I guess the colors, you know, the differences do come. It's just that, that that's just Mother Nature. I mean, sometimes they're different colors. You can't do anything about it. But here it is. And we're just going to take a look at it. You notice his eyes are still the same, still the same color. There's not much difference between the colors. It's still orangey, yellow, and then there's that big snake line is what I'm calling. I'm calling it snake line because I like the name of snake line. Essentially, you know how snake, they have that one line down its, uh, I guess, it, it, reptile, I mean, uh, down its thing. You even see it in some of the games, I mean, <laughs> not games, some of the movies, you know, um, The Hobbit, yeah, The Dragon and The Hobbit, so The, the Dragon and The Hobbit had that eye as well, so definitely um, not something that's totally different from other reptiles, but here it is, this is the baby form again, this is how it roars, if you're wondering, Get that in there once more. Alright, so there it is. That's pretty much it. That's how it roars. Baby form. We're going to evolve it to the second form now. Third evolution. Oh, and here it is again. It is gigantic. I mean, every time I see that, especially on the, for the first time, I'm, you know, I'm just shocked. But every time... You see the change from the baby to the adult. It's just so, so big that it sends a shocking kind of sense down your spine. But anyways, there it is. Let me zoom out a bit so you can see it walking around. Again, it is a pretty, pretty big animal. Let me just move this. All right, that was a bad idea. All right, we're tapping the wrong things. Well, let me just bring this one to do a little size comparison. Here it is. This is how big it is. And this is how big this one is. You notice, you know this. You know this guy can eat this guy live, literally live. I mean, open his mouth and start swallowing him in. But anyways, that is the third evolution, and we're gonna move on as we take a look at his final form to see what it looks like. Alright, so what it says here is that this is the final evolution, and apparently, apparently, you know, it, it, I'm, I'm not saying it, but, you know, if you're a Tyrannosaurus lover, it says that, apparently, um, it was likely more powerful, likely, you know, I'm going to highlight those words because, obviously, they're making claims, and, you know, it, it's not 100% true, you, they don't know it's true, it's one of those guesses. It's likely more powerful than the Tyrannosaurus. Essentially, that's what they're saying. And, you know, if you're a T-Rex fan, you stay cool and know that th that's what they're saying. And that's their hypothesis. That's what they're guessing. They don't know that. They don't know if that's true or not. But anyways, we're going to move on and check out the form. Alright, so here it is in final form. I gotta say, the colors are getting stranger and stranger. What you see here is this really fast-moving crocodile. 
and he has blue coloring, you know, sea-like coloring, and he has darker sea-like blue as stripes, and then around those stripes are yellow. It is yellow. I don't, I don't know where the yellow is coming from, but yellow is in there. I guess from his eyes, maybe, but there it is. Baby form this creature. Let's tap on it. That's what it looks like when it roars. Again. Alright, let's feed it to the final form and check that one out. Alright, again, there it is. Really big crocodile. You notice, again, there's those colorings I was talking about. Dark blue, like, you know, the light blue I like. It's kind of like aqua, right? And the yellow that surrounds it. That's the thing that's weird. The yellow. <laughs> where, where are yellow coming from? Uh, I don't really get that one, but there it is. There is yellow, unfortunately. Well, it really depends on you. If you, if you like the yellow color. But isn't, like, blue and, like, yellow both primary colors? So, I don't think they're supposed to go together that well, right? Because it becomes green. Doesn't blue and yellow become green? It's supposed to become green? But anyways, yeah, that is about it for this video. That is a little look at this DNA dinosaur. We'll be back with the next battle video. So be sure to check that one out as well on the channel. And that is pretty much it for this video. We'll be back in the next video.